Hello, this is a tutorial of creating a kitchen zone models and firstly I will show you how to create a furniture it will contain of cabinets that there top cabinets and a storage place and hall I will show you a scene yeah we are going to get something like this well maybe not exactly okay so let's begin uh, uh, modeling is really simple you just need some knowledge and to know some measurements uh, dimensions uh, of the kitchen so I will show you I will tell you so just follow me okay type 2100 600 and close and type again 600 and close delete this line and make this a group and extrude it 860 sorry 860 make two lines in uh, 120 yes just like that extrude them for 14 millimeters 14 millimeters and oh, sorry 20 millimeters and 20 millimeters very good uh, okay so now let's create a top simple rectangle any side make a group and extrude it 40 now get all the edges like this and like this very good now maybe ex extruded for 25 millimeters uh, this is a place for the door and rovers and also I would like to make a board down there so let's create it and it's really simple type in 14 draw a line straight line and to the bottom now well in reality it's impossible to make such a top so let's make it more realistic type in one draw the line and separate it also do not forget to delete unnecessary lines I recommend you doing this let's create another board and let's type 600 we do not need it if you haven't seen where uh, there is a higher cabinet so we do not need the uh, board so type in 600 and make oops sorry and uh, delete it well I've made a mistake so let's just fix it it's really simple drag this board down there and now everything is okay perfect now separate these two boards and also I just forgot to type to extrude it 25 millimeters now we can separate it type in 1 millimeter and push it delete unnecessary lines I always do it not to face problems in the future okay well to give it some life select three clicks three clicks and three clicks round 
corners in 3D type them well 2 millimeters will be good and 6 segments it's processing sometimes it it takes some time so I will pause the video to save some time and I will wait now it's uh, pretty fast yeah it's done we have perfect edges and corners let's create some drawers and um, doors so hide the top a hidden geometry off and type in 600 this would be a higher cabinet type in 200 this would be a, this will be a a vertical drawer also 600 for sink or maybe 800 it's no difference and in the middle point now well make something like this and this there is no difference just make to look at something like this let's create a doors and rollers okay so 200 for another vertical drawer we would be together and the opening will be with only one hand okay so 600 for cooker or oven and leave everything for drawers so it's a one one four two let's type one four two and three five nine three five nine perfect now we're gonna use offset tool so select and type in one and do the same things exact uh, except uh, the oven place it's pretty fast you see and where when you are done we need some fixes between these two doors drag this line for about 20 millimeters and now two clicks to select and control on your keyboard select everything now make a group open and again select everything and using joint push pull tool extrude them 18 millimeters click enter just perfect it's perfect now and need some details so let's add select all the planes on the planes and choose round corners in 3d make three maybe well four and six segments yeah it's, it's a little bit too much so let's type in three that's what i thought i will pause the video now well it, it wasn't dwarf so okay when we are done let's close it we will hidden geometry and unhide at top okay now create some top cabinets okay let's oops sorry well these planes and board this plane and board are yes we are glue good so unglue 
and also draw the line. Use your arrow keys and keyboard. Now create a doors in this cabinet. Type in 18 and well I forgot to group it. Type in type in 18 or drag your mouse there and round corners. Now extrude this. I don't know how much, but let's have some calculations. Let's okay, it's 600 for an empty space and 700 for upper cabinets. So it means it's one meter 13 centimeters. Let's extrude it. Perfect now. Get some separation and make some offsets. Also make group. Open it and extrude. Well, it's not a good thing. I haven't made an extrusion, good extrusion there. So I will separate it mechanically. And now I will make a group. Don't be afraid of mistakes from mistakes you are learning and all the pro professionals have mistakes in their, in their projects okay so round corners explode this group don't touch anything just plus and select these two groups and make it group When you are done, open it and explode doors. You now have a one group. Let's create some upper cabinets. As I said, it would be a 700. Hey, okay, 700. Let's type in 300 now and make this extrude type in 300 or there is another way just copy a line and type in 300 and extrude it again okay very good now there is a 400 leave it or let me see what we have in my project I have uh, only one door so leave it and make other one tell the place something about 300 now um, make well to looking good make something like this you can zoom and make uh, very uh, well I don't know to make it look good also separate these two I don't know I've made now it but it doesn't look so good so we need a line there so let's do it well it looks better now also use offset I said you it's really simple now 
drag this or twenty. Also make a group of them and in the group we gonna extrude them and type 18 enter very good now we need just to round the corners it's okay I will wait oh, it's pretty fast and we have already made all the cabinets only a shelf needed but I will show you how to create it later when we have a chimney hood so let's create an illusion of a storage place it's really simple and fast type in let's create a rectangle also make it group uh, always work with groups it's an advice and all the prof professionals uh, suggest working with uh, groups because it doesn't uh, make um, it it makes sketchup work easier so divide in three segments and divide this also in three segments it's good now and make some some details to make some details I will create well type in 50 and drag this line and draw a new line make a group open it extrude for one centimeter select front plane and round it this would be a metal this would be a wood and let's say it's a illusion of the doors if you understand me I will show you if you don't something like this okay continue let's scale it a little little let's type in yeah it's good and lift it for about one millimeter also I suggest you lifting cabinets by one millimeter or maybe 0 0.5 I always do this and also fill the gaps and delete the necessary lines okay so I've made the uh, cabinets storage and see you on the next tutorial